the nation. Mm. It's the lightning round. Give me some lightning, please. Wakanda! 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 And let's start off with LeBron James. To Lakers rumors, a piece written by SB Nation's Tom Ziller suggests the youngest team in the league, the Lakers, mm -hmm. have the building blocks the King needs to get a chip. George. Can the Lakers offer more to LeBron than the Cavs? Yes, because they've got more cap space, so he can bring another max-level player with him. And you mentioned those young players. You can keep some. You may be able to move some, potentially, for another, a third star, potentially, depending on who you're actually moving. So there's a lot of flexibility. Yeah, you're talking about young assets. You talk about ownership you can respect and trust. Think about that. And let's be real. Going down the hill as a superstar with the Lakers is a lot different than Cleveland because Kobe got that bye-bye hush money, which was amazing. However, Lakers, young roster, great. In Los Angeles, great. But they're still in the West. Ooh. And that is a major point against them because LeBron yeah. doesn't want to go to the West. He doesn't want that noise. Oh! <laughs> I don't know if he wants that noise I don't know. <laughs> But I, I, I think that we what? still are seeing peak LeBron. And I'm thinking down the line, three, four, five years, when the Golden State Warriors are no longer the top team either, yeah. LeBron's the third option, maybe the fourth option. He's still with the Lakers. He still can get a chip. So just because he's in a position to get a chip doesn't mean he has to be the leader of that team. He can be a key factor of that team because these young players are developing to ballers. More about LeBron not wanting that noise. The best player in the world wants it, to avoid. Who said what? he didn't want the uh, playoffs reseeded? Oh, Wonder why. Good point. Next up, the Grizzlies have lost 14 straight games and have the league's worst record. Mm. Last night, they had four undrafted players on the court, and they even had a guy, Xavier Rayton Mays, who didn't have his name on his jersey. Oh, that's mm. messed up. George, <laughs> Grizzlies taking tanking a little too far. Yeah, of course they are. You got a dude on the floor who's making his NBA debut, or, or maybe he wasn't. I don't know. I've never heard of him. 10-day. Uh, right, he's out of 10-day. And he doesn't have a name on the back of his jersey. That that should explain it all. They should have traded Marcus Gasol when they had the chance. Yeah, it's interesting when we say tanking, we're thinking about ownership to the players, maybe the coaches involved in certain <laughs> terms of what roster he puts out there on the actual court. But the equipment manager's in on it, too? Like, the equipment <laughs> manager, you make good yep. money, and you got one job. Get the jersey right. Wait, Get the uni wait, right. Wait, Come on, wait, bro. Wait, hold on. Hold on one second. Hold on. Hello, hello, is Fisdale? Is Fisdale available? Oh. Yeah, yeah, this is Memphis. We'd like to offer you an apology. Oh. Uh, we're sorry. It wasn't your fault. We were rash. We should have waited for you. My bad. Oh, by the way, if you see Earl Watson, this is Phoenix. Let him know that we were bad about that, too. <laughs> you are stupid. Uh, Take that for data. Yeah, Take that for They should have traded Tyreek Evans, too. This is the situation they're in. If I'm yeah. a fan, I'm thrilled. They got no young talent on that team. Something needs to change. It's mm. the right move for them strategically. Yeah. But, I mean, the Miami Heat are playing with a bunch of you know, nobody's too, and they still find it. Well, they got one all-star over there, but respect that. Uh, next up, fans of UCF's football team, very close to being able to purchase a Florida license plate celebrating the Knights as national <laughs> champions after their 2017 undefeated season. Let's go, LZ. Love or hate this. What was that song from Frozen that everybody like? Let it go? Let, let it go. Let it go. Let, let it go. Let it go. Heck yeah, I'll sound better than you. Oh. Damn, you can't say it better than that. Why let it go? Who in this world is thinking about UCF football right now, this day, without them continuing to poke that bear and say, yeah. we're national yeah, champions? There, Smart marketing. Yeah. And Smart if, you're, marketing. if you're triggered by a license plate, that's on you. Like, you've been trolled successfully. Let yeah, it go. You know what? Let, let let Lane go. Kiffin would absolutely do the same thing if he was yeah. in that situation. Yeah, yeah. That's how you troll people, man. Yeah, let it, it go. There's, why let it go, though? Because this is brilliant. You're not agitating anybody in a, in, a, in a malicious way. You're just making people say, damn, that little school did something last year, and that's going to help in recruiting, in the branding. Who's talking about UCF football you know what without helps this? Recruiting the branding. Thank you. What helps in recruiting the branding is the young man that went to the combine and showed out from UCF. That, that helps. helps recruiting branding. This license plate thing, eh, let it go. Just keep yourself in the news, though. That's how you got to do it. Thank you. It's a new day, let brother. got to be polarizing to be successful in this world. It starts from the top. Next up, <laughs> oh, this story right here, Canelo. Canelo oh. Alvarez tested positive for a banned substance that he says showed up in his system because he ate contaminated meat. Mm. The Canelo Triple G rematch is scheduled for Cinco de Mayo, George. How big a deal is this? I mean, it's a deal. I don't know if it's a huge deal because he's still going to fight. If he wasn't fighting, then it'd be a much bigger deal. But this is boxing, where drama is king. That's what they sell more than anything else, Marcellus. Yeah, but this is disturbing. One, uh, a lot of speculation was Canelo amped up, juiced up for the first fight. I have doctors texting me during that fight all the way through this 
positive test saying Canelo better be on that stuff again. And then this comes out and you act like it's an accident and then blame your own country. Yeah. No, the Turn accident part is ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. Uh, He's on something, right? right. Okay. So that to me changes how I look action. at the fights. Clen Buterol, I might be mangling the word. It's, you know, it's something we've heard in the past. It's happened to actually NFL players yeah. eating this tainted meat. It's not a new thing. They were lying too, though. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, stop. Everybody been in Mexico. Ain't nobody got tainted. I mean, so this is stop. a huge thing. We talked about it on Mornings <laughs> with Keyshawn, George, and LZ today. Oh. In which you have people oh. tweeting us saying. Good show. Yeah, it's a very good show. People are tweeting us saying, you embarrassed the entire country. Yeah. Right. So this is more than just about you still being able to fight. This is about whether you can go home again. Yeah, this is Golden Boy 2.0. It turns out how the Mexican fans love him and put him up there, fuck him up. Then you're going to turn your back on him like that? Sad. Next up, this Titans fan has a 2017 AFC Championship tattoo. Mm -hmm. Obviously, the Titans didn't win, so this fan simply crossed out the seven to make yeah. it 2018. Yeah. This guy yeah. really loves his division championships. That's his goal. Mina. Would you ever get a division championship tattoo? Yeah. I know the answer. This is just a setup for the. Yes, I do have a championship tattoo. Uh, no, I did see. not play. No, no, no. no. This is, oh, 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 no. Oh, oh, no, we don't do that on this show. No, oh, oh, I like my job. Yeah. Chill out. Time's Chill out. Me too. Me, me too. Me too. Let me know if it's clean. <laughs> Nina. Uh, it's a, that's like the the Colts doing the AFC finalists. Like it's a little bit sad to okay. get you know the divisional tattoo. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, no. I kind of want to see it now, but do it in a way where we don't get. Come on, man. Go ahead, Mina. Wait a minute. Oh, where, where is the location? There it is. What is that? On, on the arm. All right, okay. Roman numerals. Help LZ out. Hey, hold up. Dropped out of school twice. Remember. Uh, no, 48. Oh, that's not a real <laughs> divisional thing. No, it's the Super Bowl. The it's the number number they your won. mic. We lost yeah. your mic. Oh, you lost your mic. Sure, I'm going to have your mic. Okay, so you have 48 because. Uh... Okay. There you go. All right. Boy, I need to go to Mina's house for the Super Bowl party next time. <laughs> <laughs> they tattooing Super Bowls on their arms. Wow. Uh, LZ, would you go that far? Uh, for the Lions? Uh, I mean, they, they haven't won in how long? I ain't doing no tattoo on. You were gonna tattoos put, are longer. You were going to do locks? Different color locks. Yeah, a like blue it. lock is totally different than, you know. No. The worst part about this is it's okay to change the 7 to the 8. Trust me, I forged a lot of signatures in my days. You can do it. You can't change an eight to a nine. No. It ain't happening, right? Uh, yeah. They're not winning the division yeah, next yeah. year. No, think not. about it. Uh, Jacksonville and Houston, y'all better stop. Uh, I thought you were inside. Ain't, ain't, no, no, ain't no damn Tennessee no winning that division. And the part we're, we're not talking about, it's a division. Thank you. Yes, you're, only winning, that's what I'm right. to say. you're not winning the championship like Mina did, right, or right. even the conference, maybe, but that's pretty I, whack, too. Yeah. The division? Get out of here. Yeah. Way to cover yourself, too, right there, Mina. Wow. Oh, all right, hang in there. Coming up, <laughs> this happened in a pickup hard. game. Should this guy get subbed out immediately? Oh, I mean, immediately. Yeah. You got to go. Back to your tattoo, though, Mina. Um, oh, really? This is Sports Nation. Any other Super Bowls? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>